Here we have the 2022 Honda CRV EXL all wheel drive. Comes with a 1.5 liter four cylinder engine, an automatic transmission in a beautiful white color. Let's take a look inside. Before we take a look inside, let's take a look at the key fob. Key goes up with the remote start engines. We've got that going for us right now. Starts up just beautifully there for us. Let's hop inside this unit now. Come inside, we do have a nice wood trim right there. Our, our memory seats and our power locks, windows and mirrors along this leather armrest. Also have that premium black leather upholstery, the power driver and lumbar support. Hop inside. On the left side here, we have our lane departure uh, mitigation, our uh, windshield wiper de-icer, power trunk button, forward collision alert, and our traction control button on or off. Left here, we do have, I guess first thing I should probably start up the vehicle there fully for us, there we go. Uh, on the left side there, we do have our automatic headlight and fog light controls. On the left here, uh, we do have some controls for our uh, digital gauge up there, as you can see, as well as radio, audio, Bluetooth controls. On the right side, we do have our heated steering wheel button, adaptive cruise control functions as well. Let's go through some of these options here on the digital gauge. First things first, you see your oil life and your digital speedometer. Change this via this button right here. Get your maintenance information there for you. Whatever music you have playing will show up there. If you have your phone connected, you'll show your phone options there. And right here you have your, um, to change your speed and distance units. All wheel drive for information. Driver attention level. And our range till empty, average fuel, and all that good stuff. Moving over, have a nice infotainment screen here. You have our two air vents above that with our hazard lights. Hop into our audio, check out these sources that we have available. We do have FM, AM, Shirts, XM, USB, iPod, and Bluetooth available. We also do have Alp CarPlay and Android Auto that you can connect via Bluetooth or via USB, which is kind of nice. Uh, phone, like I said, you can connect your phone via Bluetooth. If you do, you'll have access to your phone book, your speed dial, call history, and all that good stuff. Uh, hop into our settings here. Got tons of settings, your clock, info, camera, your Bluetooth and Wi-Fi, smartphone, audio system. Uh, hop into our vehicle settings here. Take a look at the driver assist system setup. We do have the forward collision warning, the adaptive cruise control forward vehicle detect, the lane keeping assist, road departure mitigation, and the driver attention monitor. So we do have tons of safety features available in this CRV EXL. Got your Honda link here as well that you can connect. Obviously not gonna connect that right now. And that'll do it for the input team. We've got an instrument panel there, right there, too. The dual zone climate control down here as well. Uh, if you click the climate button, it'll bring up the climate on there so you can turn your AC on or off, your mode, and your fan level there. Uh, if heated seats with the driver and passenger, you have three different levels of heat. You can see uh, front and rear defrost, electronic park brake, and our uh, brake hold, auto start and stop, and our econ mode. We'll take a look at the backup camera. This is kind of nice. Down there, we do have two USB inputs, two cup holders, nice big center console there for us, as well that does slide back and even more extra storage. Close that up to make it look a little more clean. Nice power tilt side center up here with our sunglass holder, garage door opener, uh, our push and tilt slide center of controls, interior lighting options, a nice rear view mirror. Let's take a look outside. Front, we have our LED daytime running lights and our halogen headlights, fog lights there. Also, a nice gloss black and chrome finish grill with a Honda badge in the middle and our engine block heater input just right down there. Have our Bridgestone tires on our gray and silver alloy Honda rims. Those are super clean in my opinion. We have our paint matching door handles and rear tinted windows with those silver roof rails as well. A beautiful CRV tail lights here. CRV badge on the left, all wheel drive badge on the right. Let's open that up via the power trunk button. Opens up nice and easy there for us. As you can see, First thing you see is a trunk privacy cover, which is nice if you have anything of value in here, or just anything in general. You have it under there when you close the uh, trunk, we'd love to see inside. Also have additional storage under there with our spare tire and our lift kit. Not sure what this is, but we'll just throw that up there. Comes the room back here, and to close, we do have a power trunk button right there. Closes nice and easy there for us. Now let's take a look at those back seats. Here's back, we have a nice armrest here with our power windows and our heated seats. You have a nice uh, wood trim there for us, which is kind of clean. Tons of legroom and headroom in the back here. So much room back here. Uh, same leather uh, upholstery as you have in the front. Inside, you got those two rear air vents and two USBs there for your 
uh, rear passengers so you are not left out there. You can still charge your phones, iPads, and whatnot. You have a nice uh, fold down armrest and cup holder there for you as well if you have no one in that middle seat. And these seats do also fold down a nice 60 40 split. You tab right here, give that a pull. Seats go down nice and easy there, giving you easy access into the back, cut the storage room, wherever you got your skis, snowboards, golf clubs, you will have the room in the rear of the CRV. The back outside. That'll wrap it up for the 2022 Honda CRV All Wheel Drive EXL in a beautiful white color. If you have any questions or want to book a test drive, please feel free to visit us at parkmaz.ca. Thanks for watching, everybody, and we'll catch you in the next one. Have a good day.